yourself warmed up. So let's get started with our 10 jumping jacks. Whether it's high impact or low impact jacks, you've got 10. Once you have done 10, we're gonna alternate 10 front lunges. Keep the lunge nice and small. We don't have to get very deep in this lunge, but we're gonna do 10 total. So five on the left, five on the right. Just getting hips, knees, ankles nice and warmed up, ready to go. Once you have done 10, we're going to do leg swing front and back. Don't forget to hold on to something for balance when you need to. We're going to do 10 swings on, on each leg. Getting that hip a little bit more warmed up, ready to go. Once you have done 10 swings on each leg, now we're on to your mat. And we're going to go into a spider climb rotation. We're going to do 10 total, so five on each side. So starting at a high finger push up position, step foot to the hands, open that same hand up to the ceiling, step that foot back. Same thing on the other side. Eyes are going to fall that hand up. Five on each side to make your ten, getting into that hip, chest, and shoulder. Once you have done ten, stay down in your plank position, and we'll finish with either ten plank pull or ten plank jack. Either jump or step those feet out to the side. Then we are gonna rock and roll. So, what is happening for your body weight conditioning today? We have three circuits. Each circuit is going to get done twice. We're going to do 25 seconds on, 10 seconds off. So, it's going to move pretty quick. So, move number one. We're going to start with some butt kicks. So, you want to bring your heels as close to your glutes as you can. So, you can run it or you can step it. The goal is to move as quickly as possible to get that heart rate up and you keep it up. Move number two so you know where you're going. Skaters from side to side. So you can hop it or jump it or you can step it. Again, you can judge how hard you want to make each of these exercises as we go through the three circuits today. So, bike kicks, skaters, and I'm going to help you guys do the rest. All right, you ready? 25 seconds on the timer. Here we go. So butt kick, getting our heels. Let's pull towards glutes as we can. Keeping that tall posture, abs nice and tight. Low impact is here. Moving as quickly as you can through the arms, through the legs. 10 seconds. And then we're gonna skate it out, side to side. We've got that 10 second break between each move. Remember, you can hop it, you can step it. You can stay more upright, which also makes it easier. Or the lower you get the hand to the floor, the bigger your range of motion, the more challenging. So you've got lots of ways to make this easy, make this hard. Either way, we've got 10 seconds left. And then we're gonna do some cross body punches. All right, so hands up by the ears, knees soft, abs tight. We're gonna punch across, pull it back, punch across, pull it back. Here we go. So nice and quick, pivoting through that hip, knee and ankle, arm coming out parallel to the floor. Again, moving as quickly as you can. 10 seconds left. We got some power. Jumping jack coming up. In four, three, two, all right. So, power jack. So as you do the jumping jack, we jump down into the squat. And then here, low impact. You step it rather than jump it, that's it. Eyes up, chest up, and again, 
We want to sit those hips back, keep that chest up, bringing those hands overhead as much as you can. Five seconds left. And then we're down on the mat, mountain climbers. So we're on our hands, we're on our toes. We need to make this easier. Elevate your hands off the floor. All right, hip deck. We're gonna run those knees into the chest. Keeping those shoulders down, abs tight, back flat. I don't want this. Get those hips down, parallel to the floor. 10 seconds left, come on. And then we're just gonna stay down, guys. Don't even get up. All right, we're gonna drop some forearms. Stay on the toes. Plank, toe, tap, out to the side. All right, forearms, toes, half it. Again, you can make your legs as big or as small as you want. Small, easier. Big, harder. So play around with that guy. 10 seconds left. We stay down for one more move. Hands five, four, whoop, three, two. You got it, guys. All right, plank, shoulder tap. Everyone back onto their hands, knees or toes. We're gonna tap up those shoulders. Here we go, pop it up, tap it. Keeping that belly button pulled into the spine. Back nice and flat. I don't want this. Remember, same thing, you need that off the knee. We have 10 seconds. We stand up, you're gonna stand in front of your mat. So, your mat is behind you. We're gonna do surrender. We're gonna kneel down. We're gonna stand back up. So whatever leg goes down first, comes up first. Now you can stay all on one leg, and then just remember to do the other leg for round two, or you can alternate. Whatever works best for you. The key, not to stop. All right, guys, five seconds, and then we're back to the top of those butt kicks. Good, grab the water whenever you need it. All right, butt kick, jump it or run it, or step it. Here we go. Getting those heels nice and close to your butt. Keep that posture up, keep those abs nice and tight. You can start with a run, you can finish with low impact, whatever works for you, so that you don't stop. Come on, five seconds. We're gonna skate it out side to side. Good, so remember with those skaters, you can jump it, you can step it, get low, stay high. Here we go. Make it work for you guys, that's all that matters. Keep those eyes up, try not to look down at your feet. You can start with the jump, you can finish with the step. Again, make it work for you so that you don't stop. Five seconds, guys. Drop body punches, coming up. Woo, take a couple of nice big deep breaths. Hands up. Remember, rotate, hit me an ankle. Get that arm parallel to the floor. Here we go. Again, moving as quickly as you can. From side to side. Keep those abs tight. That's it, guys. Come on, 10 seconds. Power jacks. Those are coming up. You can jump them. You can step them. You can do a bit of both. You got it. So remember, as you squat down, Hands come overhead. Here we go. Good. Remember, low impact. We step it. And I want you to sink down as low as you can into that squat. That's it. Five seconds, and then we hit the deck, starting with our mountain climbers. Find your mat. Remember, you can elevate those hands, guys, if you need to. The higher your hands are off the floor, the easier they get. Run those knees into the chest. Keep those hips down, back flat. Another button pulled into the 
Staying on our hands, staying on our toes, tapping it out. All right, you ready? And again, you can elevate the hands to make this easier as well. That's it, guys, come on. Make those legs as big or as small as you need to. 10 seconds. Good, plank, shoulder tap, coming up. Good, staying on the hands. I realized we did those plank toe taps on the forearms last time. It's all good. All right, ready? Pop it up, tap those shoulders. Again, watch your hip. I don't want your butt up here. Get that back flat, hip square, belly button pulled up into the spine. 10 seconds left. And then we get to stand up, guys. We finish off with those surrenders, then we move on. All right, make sure you're standing in front of your mat. If you did all one leg on that point, gotta switch legs. So whatever leg goes down first, comes up first. Whether you alternate or stay all on that second side, keep that tall posture so eyes are up. Try not to look down at your feet. Keep your abs nice and tight. You got it, five seconds guys. Can you get one more breath in? Woo! There it is, grab some water for me. All right, same, same, different moves. We're gonna start with a reverse lunge, tap back. So I need you to pick one leg. And again, we're gonna move quickly through the leg. So, sit it down, lunge back. So this is what we're up to. The lower you can get, the more you're gonna feel that front leg part. We're gonna left side and the right side. You knew I had to put burpees in, those are next. One burpee, one jack. One burpee, one jack. You ready? Here we go. Sit down, tap back. So sit down nice and low. Keep that chest up, keep your abs nice and tight. Pump through those arms. Again, our goal is to get that heart rate up, guys. You gotta keep it up. You got it, you got it, you got it, come on. Shake it out. Same thing, other leg. And then we're going to move into that burpee with the jumping jack. Grab a seat. Here we go. Tap back. Draw that knee in. Keep that core nice and tight. Pump through those arms. Moving as quickly as you can. Through the arms, through the legs. Come on. Now, the more upright you are, the easier. The more you sit down. You're gonna challenge that front leg more. Come on, two seconds. Now with the burpee, elevate your hands to make it easier. You can jump the feet, you can step the feet. Totally up to you. Here we go, one burpee. When you come up, one jumping jack, whether it's low impact or high. You got it. Keep that core tight, guys. Belly button pulled into that spine. Five seconds left. Hit the deck. Cross body mountain climber. Knee to opposite elbow. You can run it, preferably, or step it. Here we go. Knee to opposite elbow. Elevate the hands, guys, to make it easier. Find a chair. Work it bench, coffee table, staircase, slow impact. You step it. Come on. Five seconds left. We stand back up. In four. Three. Two. Alright guys. One squat. One reverse lunge. Moving as quickly as we can. You ready? So one squat, one lunge. One squat, one lunge. Eyes up, chest up. Sitting back into that squat as deep as you can. Drop that back knee down as far to the floor as you can. You got it, come on. Five seconds. We're 
We're gonna do a cross body, knee to elbow, fancy oblique move. So, elbow to opposite knee, come across, set it down. Moving as quickly as we can, you ready? Cross, cross. Now, if you need to hold on to something, find a wall, find a chair. It all works. Think about what those abs are doing. Pull the belly button in. Drive that knee. See if you can get that knee to elbow to touch. You got it, guys. Come on. Five seconds. We switch sides. Nice. Shake there. Take one or two nice big deep breaths. We've got that other side to do, and then rinse and repeat. Here it is. Think about what those abs are doing as that knee comes up and that elbow comes across. Pull that belly button into the spine. Find a focal point for those eyes for balance. Hold on to something if you need to. That's it. Five seconds. Reverse lunge, tap back, coming up. Woo! All right, you ready? Remember, the lower you can sit, the more challenging it's gonna be. Grab a seat, here we go. Pump through those arms, guys. Keep that belly button pulled into the spine, eyes are up. I want that nice neutral back. I don't want you all hunched over. Pull those shoulders back. 10 seconds. Move as quickly as you can, come on. Last five. Oh, shake that leg out, we got that other side to do. And then one more time, a little burpee jumping jack. All right. Grab a seat, here we go. Pass back, drive that knee in. Pull that belly button into the spine again. Keep your eyes up, don't look directly down at the floor. We want to keep that tall chest. Come up out of it if you need to make it easier. Come on. Five seconds. Three. Alright guys, remember with those burpees, elevate your hand to make it easier. Jump it or step it. One burpee, one jumping jack. Keep that core tight guys. You want to support that back. As the legs jump up behind us. Ten seconds left. Remember, elevate the hands if you want to make this easier. Knee to opposite elbow. Hip to deck. Keep those hips down. Belly button pulled into the spine. Shoulders down away from the ears. Watch that this does not happen. Get those hips down, guys. Come on, 10 seconds. And then we stand back up. In five. Four. Three. Two. Ooh. One squat, one reverse lunge. One squat, one reverse lunge. Moving as quickly as we can. All right, squat, lunge, squat, lunge. Find a focal point for those eyes. Tighten up that core again. Drop that back knee down as much as you can to the floor, guys. 10 seconds left. We're gonna do that cross body knee to elbow crunch. In four, three, two. Shake those legs out. Pick a side left or right. Think about what those abs are doing as you come across the body. Here we go. Please stand by. Keep those eyes up. Find a focal point for balance. Hold on to a wall or a chair if you need to. Nice work, guys. Come on. We've only got one more side to do. We're going to grab some water. Ooh, shake it out. Take one or two nice big deep breaths. One more side. Then we're going to grab a drink and move on to the last one. Bit. Here it is. Across. Remember, hold on to something if you need to. 
Think about what those abs are doing as you pull that knee in and bring that elbow down. 10 seconds, guys. Come on, right to that timer. Let's go. Three, two. Good work. Grab some water, guys. One more circuit to go through, and then you guys are done. So, side lunge is the hop. So many years ago, EDM music was born. Now, in this circuit, we also have some skipping. If you have a skipping rope, feel free to pull that out. If not, you'll phantom skip right along with me. So, side lunge is the hop. Side lunge, hop. Side lunge, hop. Now, if you don't want to hop, you're going to side lunge, squat. Side lunge, squat. You got it? Pick a side. Left or right. Here we go. Lunge, hop. Lunge. Keep those eyes up, chest up. Push that hip out and back. The hop does not have to be huge. You got it. Five seconds and then we get to switch legs. There it is, guys. Same thing, other side. And then we're gonna go into that skipping. So if you have that skipping rope, have it close by, ready to rock. So lunge, hop, lunge. Find that focal point to the eyes again. Keep those abs tight. Push that hip out and back. You got it, 10 seconds. Good. Find that skipping rope. If not, we're going to phantom skip. We're going to keep those arms moving even though there's no skipping rope in our hands. You ready? You can do a two foot hop. You can go jumping jacks. You can go skiers. You can go side to side. You can kind of, I don't know what this one is. And mix it up guys. Have fun with it because we got walkouts next. Five seconds. All right, find your mat for me. Standing behind it or in front of it. We're gonna walk out the plank and back touch those toes, ready? Walk it out. Come back, just touch the toes. Walk it out again. Keep your eyes on the floor. Belly button pulled up into the spine. Watch your hips at the end. Don't let them drop. Don't leave them up in the air. We got five seconds. We're gonna stay down on your mat. All right, so everyone is on their hands, either from the knees or the toes. We're gonna do some reptiles for those obliques. So up it up. Bring that knee wide to the same elbow, set it back. Same thing from the knees. Just a shorter lever, which makes it easier. You can even elevate your hands off the floor so that you can stay on your toes. Good. Use those obliques to draw that knee into the elbow. Flip it over for me, guys. Flip it over. Pick a side left and right. We're going to come in knee to elbow. Let's down. Sprinters, sit up. Here we go. Come across and down. Now, you can keep just the shoulders, I'm sorry, you can lift just the shoulders or you can sit all the way up. Either way, drive that belly button into the floor. You got it, come on. All right guys, same thing, other side, and then we stay down for bicycles, and then we rinse and repeat. All right, you ready? So you can sit all the way up, or just lift that shoulder. Whatever works, but drive that belly button into the floor. Use those abs, guys, to lift the shoulders and to pull that knee in. Good. Five seconds. We stay down. Woo! All right. Both legs up. Hands behind the head. We're going to do regular bicycles. 
making those legs as big as you can. You can keep it smaller. I just don't want this. I want you to take your time. Feel those abs work, guys. And when the timer goes, you get to stand up. Good, five seconds. Lateral runs with the hop. Come on up, guys. All right, pick a side, left or right for me. Ooh. Lunge, hop. Good, eyes are up, find that focal point. Pull that belly button into the spine. Drive that hip out and back. You got it. Remember, if you're not jumping, you're squatting. Lunge, squat. Five seconds. Shake it out, guys. Out to the side. And then we're going to go back for skipping one more time. Big breath. Here we go. Lunge. Good. See if you can get a little further into that lunge now that you're more warmed up. Maybe you can make your hop a little bit bigger. Or if you're not hopping, get deeper into that squat. Come on, five seconds. Nice. Shake it out. Skipping, whether you're using a rear rope or phantom skipping with me. Three, two, here we go. Play around with your feet. Remember, you can hop it, jumping jacks, skiers, side to side, whatever this one's called. Come on, guys. Ten seconds left. We're going to find your mat. We got our walkouts next. Four, three, two. All right, guys. Now make your feet wider if you're tighter in those hamstrings, okay? All right, hands come down. Walk it out the plank. Come on back. Just touch the toes. Keep your eyes down. Belly button pulled into the spine. Walk it out as far as you can, guys. 10 seconds. Don't leave those hips up in the air. Don't let the hips drop down to the mat. All right, stay down. We have our reptiles, and then we have that sprinter sit up. Bicycle, done. All right, hands, toes, knees wide to the elbow. Same thing for the knees. Same thing if you elevate your hands onto a staircase, a workout bench, a coffee table. Make it easier if you have to. Come on, 10 seconds. Last five, we roll it over and we pick a side left or right. All right, so we have that sprinters. Sit up. So pick a side left or right. So if you can sit all the way up or just lift the shoulder. But think about what those abs are doing, guys. Push that belly button into the floor. Use the abdominals to lift the shoulders and to drive that knee into the chest. Come on, four seconds. Woo. One more side. And then we have those bicycles. And then you guys are good to go. You ready? Sit it all the way up. Just lift the shoulders. Do a bit of both. Drive that back into the spine. Put it into the mat. Come on. Think about what those abs are doing. Make them work. We've only got one move left. Three, two, four. Bicycles. Slow and control. Knees up, hands behind the head. Make those legs as big as you can. Control the movement. Do not race through it. Come on, guys. You're almost done. Finish strong. Good form. Good technique. Ten seconds. Ten, four. 